Ryan Soda 569 YouTube and Reddit. And today we're going to be looking at Scarcrow 569's solar factory that he's built on our TechIt server. And he's here with me today. Um, could you give us a bit of a run through of the surf of the um, factory? Uh, yes, I can. Um, so basically, you come straight through the front doors. Um, and then you're greeted okay. with a bunch of chests and um, like a display panel and whatnot. Oh, that's pretty cool. Um, so this has just finished its last job. Um, so this is the c computer that I craft, uh, like coded up with the display. Um, so we'll just go in here. Whoops. Type yes. All right. So this is how it sort of sort of should start. Um, yeah computer to input how many solar panels you would like to make. All right, so how many do we want to make? Like three or, or just make it one just for simple. Yeah, just sake. one should work. Um, so you've loaded the chest That's with the correct cool. material, type yes to continue. So it gives you I'm a rundown of all the materials that you need. And obviously if I had a type three, it would have been like three times that amount. Well, um, there's a little bit of tricky mass with the, uh, the rubber and the copper because of the way um, like the factory works, but yeah, so basically say yes and then it processes for 30 seconds while it gets ready. Um, what it's doing in this process stage is because of the way the maths works is that it needs to make one set of um, copper, copper cable before it starts. Um, oh, you can see the... Um, yeah, you can see the... You can see the the timing of the um, the uh, redstone as it comes out the back of the computer as well, which is pretty cool. That's the back oh, of the it just it just made one. It yeah. just made some, and then it should just pump it out into the the chest. Slowly makes its way there. All right, now it should start the rest. Yep, where it goes, you can see it all going through the pipes. Okay, now this system takes oh, a bit of lag. Uh, one point, uh, sorry, two point. Well, yeah, it's two point five minutes uh, to create its uh, little thing. Why does it? Why, why does it take so long at the moment? Like, is it just because that's the way you coded it, or? Yeah, just the way I coded it, and how it um, just basically how slow it takes the. Uh, the redstone engines to turn off and on and uh, complete their cycle while cold, cold rather. Oh, okay. Yeah. Would it be would it be very easy to speed up? Would you just like change all the engines or? Yeah, I could change all the engines to um, combustion engines, but I'd have to change the the maths in the, the code that I used. Um, I'll be posting that code on in the description so you guys can use it, take it, edit it, do what you want with it. That's cool. Um, yeah. So that that's. Yeah, coded through the Lua, the language that ComputerCraft uses, which is fun. Um, would you, what, 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 like, what would you have to, yeah, just change them all the coal engines? Would you have to change much in the code to be able to get it to go quicker, or? Uh, yeah, just, I'd say so, yeah, with the math, just to make it so it was, it takes the right amount out of each chest each time, and that there's always the right amount in the chest to be taken, sort of thing. Because um, there's little... If you can see here, like obviously I can't. I need. I need. Um, for instance, I need uh, four redstone to come out of this chest and go that way, and two to go in that chest. Now I could use a um, like a diamond pipe, but that leaves too much to chance. So I've had to use a chest with a, a like a pump. So it pumps pumps four times from that one and two times from this time, and that's that's the way I break it up. Oh, that makes sense. Yeah. Oh. Um, it also says on the screen that it updates every 2.5 minutes. Oh, it just finished. Hey. Yep, so... Why, why does it take so long to update? Like, Oh, just because of the, the loops are quite big. Because I, I have, in the code, you'll be able to see it, that it loops at for each, um, each solar panel. So, I've just, yeah, I'll just put the, it, the... The code would be massive if I was to do it every second. In the way that I'd code oh, okay. it, but, yeah. Um, just for the for the people uh, viewing the video, is Lua very hard to like learn, or um, is it like uh, easy? Is it similar to like like HTML or something nice and simple? Uh, 
it's not similar to HTML, but it's um, it's a super simple, very powerful language. It's, it's a, it would be a great one to learn, like as your first language. So if you guys wanted to get into coding, um, grab a computer craft computer and get stuck into it, and you'll, you'll probably enjoy it. It's, it's a good language. Uh, and this here is the computer, yep. right? That yeah. Is, is they like easy to make or yeah, it's super they cost easy to make a lot. It's it's oh, okay. yeah, ridiculously easy to make. It's just a smooth stone with a, a red stone in the middle and um, yeah, a piece of glass at the top. At sure. the front, rather. Yeah. Yeah, because that's how computers are made. Yeah. yeah. Just chuck some stone around a piece of red stone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bit of glass. That makes sense. All right. Well, um, I think we're just about done. Yeah. Is that all you have to show us, Scott? Yeah, I think that's about it. All good. All right, well, thank awesome. yeah. thanks for that, guys. Uh, we'll catch you in the next video. All right, see you guys.